The white dunes in Fiambala are one of Dakar's hotspots in South America. They still haunt Carlos Sainz's nightmares, he who had to abandon any hope of victory there in 2009 and 2011. Stage 5 of the rally was taking the pilots on this sandy slopes again. On today's menu, 151 kilometers for the bikes and 246 for the cars. In the car section, the forcing duel between the Hermes and the Minis has been keeping its promises so far. Yesterday, the German firm driver starred. Stefan Petteronsel even took the top seat of the overall ranking, helped by Nasser Alatia's misfortune in the race. However, every day is a different story. At the first checkpoint, the Kateri was in the lead ahead of Christoph Holofsek and Robbie Gordon, his teammate. Behind, Stefan Petterensel was doing what he had to in order to stay in contact. The Frenchman was the fourth fastest at 2 minutes 37 seconds of Alatia. But like yesterday, the rest of the special didn't go smoothly for the 2011 winner. His Hummer, number 300, got stuck for several minutes and it made him lose a precious time. That was godsend for the countryman. At the finish line in Fiambala, the victory went to Christoph Holofsik. The day was good for the German squad, which placed two other cars in the top four. Behind the pole in third was Stefan Petterensel, three minutes and 52 seconds adrift, and Nani Roma was fourth, more than seven minutes away. In the Hammer team, Nasser Alatia was once again expected to do well, but his teammate Robbie Gordon did better. The American ended the stage second, only one minute and one seconds from Holofsik. Stefan Petteransel still leads the general classification. The Hummers and the Mini struggle in the car section. For the bikes, the battle is within one team. The KTM riders Cyril Desprez and Marc Coma are friends and rivals. At the start this morning, the Frenchman was sitting in leading position. For the moment, these two are in a league of their own. No other pilot can compete, even when the two teammates take their time. Just before checkpoint one, they got lost for a moment. But after getting back on the right way, the Frenchman passed the intermediate 58 seconds ahead of Coma. In Fiambala, things were unchanged, the duo was still there. For a major part of the special, Depre has driven in his rival's wheel and won in the end, increasing his advance on Coma by 1 minute and 41 seconds. What a shame for Franz Verhoeven. He had started the special at Coma and Depre's pace, but was then bothered by mechanical problems. For his part, Joan Barredabord did good. The Spaniard finished third best of the day in 2 hours, 41 minutes and 15 seconds. Cyril Depré confirmed his leading position at the GC with a split of 9 minutes and 50 seconds over Marcoma. Helder Rodriguez completes the podium more than 47 minutes behind Depré.